so dirty. <laughs> dude, I, dude, I love Robert De Niro, dude. I'm a huge fan. Yeah, I actually trust him on like Al Pacino at this point. I don't know. Adam Sandler movie. He was an Adam Sandler. He did a rap about some. Well, he's nuts. I heard it was awful. I love him, but he's nuts. Yeah, so is Robert De Niro. Well, yeah, that's true, but he's a different level of nuts. Different kind. One has some smart choices in there. Are you ready, Pumpkin? <laughs> yes, Blueberry. <laughs> <laughs> Please play the movie. You opened up that game. Hey, guys, this is Trailer Watch 2016. I'm Brian Alex Clark. And I'd be Mark Conway from the Bisque. From the Bisque. What are we going to be watching today, Mark? We're going to be watching Dirty Grandpa Official Dirty Trailer in Cinemas 2016. It's the official Dirty Trailer. <laughs> and while we watch it, are we going to be cuddling? No. Okay. No, that's not going to happen. No. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but but no. All right, I'm going to redo this trailer reaction with somebody else who will cuddle. Play the damn play. <laughs> <laughs> Press play, damn it. <laughs> what? Like Look at that beard. It's just with the rehearsal brunch on Friday. That's a lot more than that, really. I'm ready. You don't have to worry about anything. Grandpa, I'm ready to hit the road. I thought the plan was to have breakfast here. That's your breakfast. Now let's get in that giant labia you drove up in and get the fuck out of here. Nice. This president didn't have the red band. Being a corporate lawyer is awesome. I get to handle SEC compliance. No shit. LP agreements. Oh, LLC agreements. You know what I'd rather do? What? I'd rather let Queen Latifah shit in my mouth from a fucking hot air balloon. <laughs> That'd be a hell of a distance. Yeah. So you guys want to tag along for a bit? Party some babies into us? We have a very important tea time. Well, obviously, I've got the bigger three wood. Good, maybe you can use it to hit your balls right into my vagina. <laughs> Would they fit? They're all pissing balls. Get back out there again. Oh, so that's what this is all about. You want me to drive you down to Boca so I can be your wing? I haven't had sex in 15 years, and I want to fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> me too, a little bit. I can't chug alcohol. I developed like a gag reflex. This kind of seems like neighbors where at first I thought it was stupid, but it, but it turned out to be really great. Ironically, it was like, look, hey, look, those are titties. We're just driving Hey, She's not smiling, smiling, man. If you marry her, you're gonna be sleepwalking through the rest of your life. For one night, stop worrying about your wedding. Actually, this guy looks more intelligent than you know, the Party, send your friend Yes, that was really intelligent. <laughs> oh! Your life is much more than one note. I smell crack. I smell crack. Yeah, but just like a lot. Man, look at them abs. Like yes. Whoa! Green pup. I found a Werther's original in the pocket and I've been sucking on it all morning. I think it's probably like 50 years old. Whoops. I guess they just slipped off. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that, that's what happened. That is exactly oh God, what, what happened. Awesome. Oh man, I hope I don't see Robert Nero's penis in this movie. I really don't. I really don't want to see that. You know? Yeah, good guy. You know, that you know what? Might, if, uh... if she did, in fact, put his balls in her vagina, that would be impressive. Like, they're like if almost this like. Was, if this was a Sasha Baron Cohen film and I saw that set up, it would have to have happened. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then she'd have to shoot them out of her vagina, just like ping pong balls. That'd be great. You know? So, uh... hey, you gotta serve somehow, you know? Two serving one? <laughs> Oh, no, there's two ovaries. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's a double date. It's two serving two. <laughs> it's actually two serving zero because he doesn't have balls anymore. They're in her, his, her vagina. For my Cali brothers, that's a double double. Yeah. <laughs> Word. <laughs> well, the trailer's not even that over yet. We're still fucking ripping out it. <laughs> Oh man, oh man, those those were some man titties, man. Like those are actually some quality <laughs> man titties. Like, like that's like that's. I'm a, learning things about you. Now. That's a solid. <laughs> that's a solid seven man titties. I mean, I have I have a nice A cup. Um, they're certainly not You're like definitely a washboard. Yeah. Oh. Oh no no no. That's not a bad thing. No, I know you. Not I'd much rather have that than. You gotta work at it. <laughs> gotta you gotta work at it. Dirty Grandpa. Mm-hmm. See it in theaters? 
Oh yeah, I'll see it in theaters. I actually want to see this with my grandfather, um, <laughs> because because he's really is a dirty grandpa. <laughs> like, he's that's he, gonna be me. Yeah, he's like that's me when. It's I'm funny. He's kidding. he's like sent me like so many sexually innuendo jokes, um, memes. Like my my friends like wouldn't send me those things, and he's 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 like he's like yeah, it's like he sent me a video of like um of like a satellite um image going into a bedroom window, and then. And, you know, I remember like back in the day when they said you can like it's a that prank website when you could track your phone number. You remember that? And then like it, it it would it would pretend that it was coming from a satellite from Earth and then zoom in and then zoom in and then zoom in and then zoom into a window and see a bunch of people fucking like <laughs> like he would send me shit like that. I saw it in middle school. It's still funny by the way. Still very very funny. Do you want to know the first joke my dad ever taught me? What was it? I uh, must have been like twelve or thirteen. All right, so there's this guy and he's next to a leprechaun and he's like, holy shit. This leprechaun is such a huge dick. I've heard this, but go on. And he's like, leprechaun, like, how do you have such a big dick? And the leprechaun goes, it's the magic, laddie. <laughs> you can have the magic, too. You just let me fuck you. It's okay. like, whoa, 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 uh -uh. no, 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 no. And he goes away, and then he's thinking to himself, he's like, well, I would be the most popular person with the ladies, and no one would ever know. So he goes back, and he's like, and the leprechaun's fucking him, and he knows this is his first time, so he's asking him some questions to make him a little more comfortable. He's like, Sue, so, what's your name? <laughs> Mike. How old are you, Mike? 34. 34, and you still believe in leprechauns. Oh! <laughs> I did hear this one, and I still told you. And it's still fucking funny. And I'm pretty sure you did tell me this. I don't know why I didn't remember, because it's really, really funny. <laughs> the thing is, oh, every man. time I've told that again like people love it of course yeah. but there was one time I was in bartending school and we were on a break and I was with these two guys who were telling jokes and I told them one and they both just were like I don't know I don't care uh, why that's funny uh, like both of them and they weren't being dicks like they weren't just being assholes they're just really stupid yeah. And they just really. Oh God. Yes. Yes. So how about you, good sir? Will you? Say, I'm sure you. You already did a reaction video to this, but will you see this in theaters? Maybe. Um, Maybe. I never did a reaction video to this. Oh, you didn't. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Well, well, that makes me um, feel better. He saved it for me. I had a follow-up question. Will you be seeing this like opening night type no. thing or matinee? That shit. No. You know what? Like, may like I definitely wouldn't matinee this because like that's just not the kind of movie. Like you know, it's it's not sound of music or anything like that. It's 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 dirty grandpa. Right. Like I would see this at night, like as a, a oh, night yeah. out. But I certainly would not see this yes. opening weekend. Um, it's not one of those um, you know, those type of movies. Um, I suppose if I had, if it worked out that way, I wouldn't say no. I wouldn't be like no, that's not happening. I do have my genuine concerns because it is released in January. And and everybody knows and that everyone knows that, from the third episode of the Bisque. <laughs> that, <laughs> that, January movies, January are, movies are, are are traditionally not that good. Although, oh, so are February movies. Um, and just be mindful. Uh, Silence of the Lambs came out in February, and also, um, um, it's a Wonderful Life came out in January. Go fucking figure. Christmas movie delivered it. Uh, <laughs> uh, open up in January. Late. Yeah, a little late. They had to desaturate all the color out of it. Yes. <laughs> Murray, you want the moon? I think I think I'd see this if like a friend asked if I wanted to go or if it was a man. I I mean, the person I most often and this is no surprise see movies with is my daughter because she wants to see yeah, movies. I so don't, I, I don't think I you want should to see. Indulge. Yeah, I'm not. I, yeah, I don't think you should see this. I movie mean, either. I would. I wouldn't. This doesn't. This would seem very harmless. But it's also it's not a movie that I think would be special. Like yeah. I I knew. Kingsman will be special. I basically know Deadpool's going to be special. Well, I hope so. So I'm okay showing those to her. Another February release, which concerns me. The... Well, I mean, it's low budget. It's such a low budget movie. They, if they put it out in summer, it would have all this big budget competition with much bigger marketing budgets. So I... I, I get that. I get that. I mean, that's, that's so... how Star Wars made so much money so quickly because there was nothing else to take from yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. What was going to beat them? <laughs> yeah, they, no, uh, they, yeah. um, a Chipmunks movie? Yeah, fuck that. I mean, you know from episode three of The Best that... Uh, Daddy's Home did a lot, yeah, surprisingly. Which is fucking but weird. People I, had to choose to go see that. That was not competition for stuff. Oh yeah, that was that was lack of uh, you know lack of options. Um, uh, the um, you know what? That's 
And that's crazy, too, because, I mean, I actually was at the movie theater um, uh, in Barrington, which, Barrington, Illinois, because we're in Chicago, by the way, and, um, uh, shout out, um, uh, and the weird part was I was going to get concessions because I actually was waiting in line to get into the theater. We had already bought our tickets. And there was an IMAX theater showing Daddy's Home. Wow. Why? I mean, since Star Wars kicked uh, no, no, but, Hateful Eight out of but like, that one art my theater. But, but, but what would possess a person to want to see Daddy's Home in IMAX? It's a good movie. I, don't, I, mean, it's a I good wouldn't movie. say IMAX. Like, like, no, no, no. Like, I, I definitely understand that. Like, but, but really, it's a comedy. There's no reason to see a comedy in IMAX. Unless it's like an action comedy, like you know, you have to be a big movie to to to, to want to spend the money yeah. uh, to go see it in IMAX. It seems rather counterproductive. But hey, that's just me. If you want to go and do that, that's yeah, more power to you. Cool. So you are your rating is nighttime with grandpa. Night yeah, nighttime <laughs> with grandpa. As creepy as that sounds, kids. Yes, nighttime with grandpa. <laughs> and mine is if a friend invites me. <laughs> yes, um, uh, and that friend may very well be his grandpa, um, or an older gentleman um, uh, that he randomly meets. But yeah. grandpa's dead. I'm so sorry. And I don't know the other grandpa. Oh uh, well, that, well, that just put us in. <laughs> Let's end the video now. <laughs> Because I have nothing else to say after that. I that's that's yeah, that's okay. my brain. I basically didn't have a relationship with that first one. Oh, that's no, nice. I just want to make that sad <laughs> everywhere. I fucking hate you right, right now. <laughs> All right, so if you like this mofo, check out his other videos on the Bisque. I'll put a link down below. They are really funny. Uh, I love the performance. I really love the writing. Don't know who does that. Um, I just. <laughs> I really love all the green screen effects. <laughs> Don't know who does that. I love <laughs> the editing. Let's let's stop it right here. At, this, at the this, very least. This is a Dutch rudder now. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you're jerking me off, but not. Yeah, it's like a totally different person. Oh, that's that's a, that's a movie I need to get high and watch again. Oh, um, uh, oh. Uh, <laughs>